praise God, praise God, praise God. We like to say a big welcome to each and every one of you tonight. The prayer for this week is big, and I know you're going to enjoy it. Please call a friend, call a neighbor to come and join us so we can all have a good time together in the presence of God. We're going to play some music for the next nine minutes or so. Now, this is going to be both for those who are calling in and those who are on the podcast. This is Luther Barnes. If you feel a little bit discouraged tonight for one reason or another, I think you will find a lot of encouragement in these selections of Luther Brown's music. This one is Jesus Cares, and I hope you know he does. Enjoy.
still holding on. Yes. No matter what you're going through, this is Luther Bond. They said I wouldn't make I'm still holding on. They said I wouldn't be here today. They said I'd never amount to anything. But I'm glad to say that I'm on my way. And I'm growing more and more each day.
don't do it. Don't do it. Don't let go of his hands, no matter what you're going through tonight. I just feel in my spirit that I need to encourage some of you on this prayer line tonight. I don't know why, but uh, this is what we need to do. And God is going to just help us. We're going to believe God. We're going to trust him. And um, we just... We're just going to let God be God and let God take control. Many of you have been through a lot of things. Many of you have been through a lot of troubles. Many of you have been through a lot of pains. And somehow in my spirit, I just feel some of you need to be encouraged today. Hold on. You've been talked about. You've been scandalized. All kinds of foolishness have been thrown your way. But God's going to see you through, no matter what the trouble on your way is. I'm going to play one more song by Luther Barnes to encourage you. No matter what trouble is in your way, God's got it all under control. Trouble in my way. Enjoy.
was Luther Barnes. It's going to be all right. And I just feel in my spirit that some of you on this prayer line are down tonight. I mean, you know, sometimes life just gets to you. And things just happen around you and you just can't handle it anymore. Someone just sent me a text while this program is going on that, Bishop, I almost didn't come tonight because I was so discouraged about something. Well, God is good. He loves you. That's why he singled you out. And he wanted me to just encourage you a little bit with those songs from Luther Barnes. Be encouraged. Everything is going to be all right. There is no mountain without a top. There is no hill without a crest. There is no problem that enjoys eternal life. This one came, and I can assure you this one will pass away too. So stay encouraged. No matter what the trouble in your way may be, God's got it all under control. Welcome. Please forgive me that I went a little bit over time on the music. I just had to do that. But I'm going to make it up for you. I'm not going to talk too much tonight. I'll just read uh, the scripture and then we'll be ready on our way. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you and worship you for bringing us together into your house. Yes, I call this your house. Because wherever we are belongs to the Lord. Bless us tonight. Give us the uh, encouragement that we need to know that no matter what is thrown our way, you are still the overruler. You are able to overrule everything. So bless us to pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. All God's people said amen and amen and amen. Genesis chapter 50. I'm reading there in verse number 15. And when Joseph's brethren saw their father was dead, they said, Joseph will peradventure hate us and will certainly requite us all the evil which we did unto him. And they sent a messenger unto Joseph, saying, Thy father did command before he died, saying, Only God knows whether that was the truth or not. Because these boys, I don't know how much of their words you can take as gospel. Anyway, they sent a messenger to Joseph, and they said, Before daddy died, he left a commandment, saying, So shall ye say unto Joseph, Forgive, I pray thee now, the trespass of thy brethren and their sin, for they did unto thee evil. And now we pray thee, forgive the trespass of the servants of the God of thy father. And Joseph wept when they spake unto him. And his brethren also went and fell down before his face, and they said, Behold, we be thy servants. And Joseph said unto them, Fear not, for I am not in the place of God. But as for you, ye thought evil against me, but God meant it unto good, to bring to pass, as it is this day, to save much people alive. Now therefore fear ye not, I will nourish you and your little ones. And he comforted them and spake kindly unto them. Can I prophesy to you tonight? You see in verse 20, I prophesy to you that every evil that is imagined against you, God will turn it to good in the name of Jesus. Every evil that is imagined against you that makes your spirit to be low, that makes you to be discouraged, that God, the overruler, will overrule the whole foolishness and turn it around for good for you in the name of Jesus. Our focal verse is at verse 20. But as for you, ye thought evil against me, but God made it unto good 
to bring to pass as it is this day to save much people alive. You know, I like what other translations say on that verse 20. One says, it is true that you planned to do something bad to me. But really, God was planning good things. <laughs> God's plan was to use me to save the lives of many people. And that is what happened. Another translation says, you tried to harm me, you did. But God made it turn out for the best so that he could save all these people as he is doing right now. Another translation says, as for you, it was in your mind to do me evil, but God has given a happy outcome, the salvation of numbers of people as you see today. Yet another translation says, you try to harm me, but God make it turn out for the best so that he could save all these people as he is doing right now. Now, the story of Joseph is nothing that I need to explain and explain and explain. Anyone who reads the Bible, even in a minor way, understands the story of Joseph. You made it, but God made it. You can now see where our theme for tonight comes from. God overrules. He is the overruler. I checked the English dictionary to make it a little bit simpler. It says to overrule is to reject or disallow by exercising one's superior authority. That means that God has a superior authority above any other person that claims to be in charge or in control in your life. The Supreme Court overruled the lower court. That's exactly what happened to Joseph. His brothers were the lower court, but God was the Supreme Court. He has the final say. You remember that song that we sing? Who has the final say? Jehovah has the final say. So you need not worry about what they are saying. Seriously. You need not worry about what they have said. And you need not worry about what they have said is accomplishing in your life. Because until the final chapter is written, until the conclusion is concluded, it's not over yet. All right? The overruler is the one who speaks last. And it says the synonyms to the word overrule means to cancel, to reverse, to rescind, to repeal, revoke, retract, withdraw, take back, rule against. I love that. Disallow, override, veto, set aside, overturn, overthrow, repudiate, recant, annul, nullify, declare null and void, invalidate, negate, void, abrogate, vacate, and recall. His brothers had authority, but God exercised superior authority. And the end of the story was that they ended up bowing to him and act that they vowed never to do. We're going to pray tonight that this year, 2021, will be your year of seeing the hands of the overruler at work in your life. Our areas of our lives, I, I will imagine every single one of us on this prayer line, you have one area of, or another in your life that you need God to overrule. The truth of the matter is this. He has overruled in so many cases. And in this case too, and I don't know what this case is for you, he will overrule for you too. Whatever you have been sentenced to by man or by devils, 
May God come down and use his executive privilege to overrule for you. I think I've spoken enough, as I promised. It's just about half past the hour. May God bless what you have heard. May your faith be strengthened as you pray tonight. And may great things happen in your life on this prayer line tonight. Have your way, O oh God. We ask you to do it in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And amen. Let's go before God with thanksgiving as usual. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. Father, we worship you. Father, we adore you. Father, we honor you. Father, we glorify you. I want you to just begin to bless him. I want you to begin to glorify him. I want you to begin to honor him. I want you to begin to adore him. I want you to begin to say, Lord, we bless you. Lord, we praise you. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we adore you. Come on, thank him. Thank him. Thank him. Thank him. Bless him. Ho Oh God, we, we, we just glorify your name. Thank him, thank him, thank him, thank him for allowing you to see another week this week. Hallelujah. Thank him for allowing you to see another week of prayers. Father, we bless you. Father, we worship you. Father, we adore you. Lord, we glorify your name. Lord, we honor you. Thank him for keeping us since last week when we parted here on Friday. And I said, we will see you on uh, Wednesday. And here we are. The one that said we will see you on Wednesday is still here. And you who we thought will be here, you are here. Father, we bless you that you did not say no to what we planned. Father, we worship you that you did not reject that which we had in plan. I want you to thank God for keeping us since we left here on Friday night. Father, we praise you and we bless you. Thank you for these many, 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 many months of praying. Many, many Wednesdays of praying. Many, many Thursdays. Many, many Fridays of praying. Father, we bless you for it. Thank you, Lord God, for still keeping our interest up. For still keeping our interest up. For still keeping our interest up in praying. We glorify you. We worship you. We adore you. Thank you for protecting us since the beginning of this week. Yes, Monday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and here is Wednesday. We are kept by the power of God. We are kept by the mercy of God. We are kept by the grace of God, and we give God a praise for that. Thank him that he has been with you since the beginning of this year. For many of you, today is the 20th. For many of you, today is the 21st. We thank God for his protection. We thank God for his keeping grace upon our lives. Thank him because of his power to overrule. Hallelujah. Concerning us, he overrules every day. There are things that God doesn't even tell you he has overruled. He just overrules it and tells you to go on without telling you anything. I want you to thank God for the things he has overruled on your behalf that you have no idea of. Father, we bless you. Father, we worship you. Father, we adore you. Father, we honor you. Father, we glorify you. Thank him, thank him, thank him, thank him. Because of he is our supreme court judge over the lower courts of men. Thank you because he is our supreme court. He is our supreme court. He is the one that has the power to overrule and to cancel everything that the enemy might have against you and against me. Lord, we glorify you. Just like you overruled for Joseph, you are still the overruler for us. We we'll bless you because you are the God that does not change. You are, you are, and you will always be. Father, glory be to your name. Honor be to your name. Dominion be to your name. Thank him for the decrease of men. Thank him for the decrease of devils that he has rendered useless so, so, so many, 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 many times. Father, we just bless you for that. We worship you for the decrees of men and the decrees of devils that you have rendered useless in our lives. Father, glory be to your name. Honor be to your name. Dominion be to your name. We thank you for what you have ruled against and overruled in our lives in the past. Hallelujah. Glory be to your name, O God. 
We bless you. We worship you. We adore you. Thank him. Thank him. Thank him. Thank him. Thank him. Thank him for strange family members whose strange purposes God has canceled in the past. God has overruled in the past. I'm talking about blood of your own blood, flesh of your own flesh, that God helped you to put down concerning what he had in mind concerning you. Thank him that he will cancel more even as we pray tonight. Yes, he will. Pray that after tonight, no evil determination against you shall remain standing in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, we thank you. Because after tonight, any evil determination against me shall not stand in the name of Jesus. That is the purpose of this prayer tonight. That God will overrule any decrease of men, any decrease of devils against your life. Whatever has been cooked together, whatever has been put together to make your life miserable, that the Lord will put them under our feet as a result of the prayers tonight. I just want you to thank him in advance for that. Thank him and say, Lord, I thank you because that's exactly what you're going to do for me. Glory be to your name, honor be to your name. I want you to thank God also that the powers of sin and unbelief that fight prayers, mercy will cover them for you tonight. Lord, I thank you because mercy will cover in the name of Jesus all powers of sin, all powers of unbelief that may want to raise their ugly heads against us. Papa, we plead the blood of Jesus. Yes, we plead the blood of Jesus against every sin. We plead the blood of Jesus against every unbelief. Father, answer prayers tonight and deliver us from any hindrance that may come from sin, that may come from unbelief. We pray that you will forgive us on any sin of omission. You will forgive us of any sin of commission. And you will cleanse us, you will purge us, you will purify us. Can I ask you to pray for grace tonight? Say, Lord, give me grace, give me grace. Give me grace to be able to pray tonight. Sometimes if you don't have grace, a prayer of one hour will look like 10 hours. But if you have grace, a prayer of one hour will look like one minute. Without me, you can do nothing, folks. I realize I cannot lead this prayer. Except God energizes me to lead it. Except God empowers me to lead it. Except God encourages me to lead it. So we all need grace. I want you to pray for the outpouring of God's grace upon your life. The outpouring of God's grace upon my life. That will be able to pray. They will be able to intercede in the mighty name of Jesus. I want you to pray for yourself and pray for me also. That will be able to have a good time in the presence of God tonight. I want you to pray that every plan of the enemy against this gathering tonight, the Lord will put them under our feet. Any plan to disrupt, any plan to hinder the prayer meeting of tonight, the Lord will disallow it. The Lord will overrule it in the mighty, 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 mighty name of Jesus. Can I ask you to pray for grace to concentrate? Can I ask you to pray for grace to focus on what we are here for tonight? There are so many distractions that the enemy will put your way. So you will not be able to focus. So you will not be able to concentrate. I want you to pray in the name of Jesus that you will be able to focus. You will be able to concentrate. And you will be able to do that business that we have come to do here tonight. Which is to pray. Which is to call on God. I want you to pray tonight and tell the Lord as we begin to pray concerning our text. Say, O Lord, my God. Say, O Lord, my God. Say, O Lord, my God. Say, as you stood up for Joseph, stand up for me, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. It was him that stood up for Joseph. That was why the end of his story was good. That was why the end of the story was pretty. That was why the end of his story was full of glory. Hallelujah. I want you to say, O Lord, as you stood up for Joseph, Please stand up for me in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, as you stood up for Joseph in the name of Jesus, there was nothing he could do against his brothers. They were too powerful for him. There was nothing he could do against Potiphar. He was too powerful for him. There was nothing he could do against Potiphar's wife. She was too cunning for him. But guess what happened? God stood up for him. Listen, if God be for you, who can be against you? I want you to say, oh Lord, by your mercy, stand up for me, oh God. 
Papa, have mercy on me and stand up for me. Stand up for me in my family, oh God. Stand up for me in my church, oh God. Stand up for me on my job, oh God. Stand up for me against family members that are stronger than me, oh God. What can you do if your mother is fighting you? What can you do if your father is fighting you? What can you do if your mother-in-law, father-in-law are fighting you? Only God can win that battle for you. I want you to say, oh Lord, as you stood up for Joseph, Papa, arise and stand up for me in the name of Jesus. Papa, I pray that you will arise for me tonight. Let tonight be a night of rising up for heaven from me, O God, by the hosts of heaven, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Papa, rise up for me, O God, that as you stood up for Joseph, you will stand up for me, O God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight and say, Lord, any family member standing up against me, I pray that you will stand up for me against them in the name of Jesus. You'll be surprised sometimes it is your father that is standing up against you. Sometimes it is your mother that is standing up against you. Sometimes it is your brothers that are standing up against you. Sometimes it is your family member, your uncle, your auntie, and your nephew and your niece that are standing up against you and they happen to be very powerful people. But do you know what? They are not as powerful as the God that we call upon tonight. I want you to pray that whoever is standing up against me, oh God, anywhere, I pray God that you will let them know that you are bigger, you are higher, you are taller in the name of Jesus. You are wider in the name of Jesus. You are the omnipotent God in the name of Jesus. Papa, whoever is standing up against me, I want you to stand up against them and give me the victory over them. Pray, 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 pray tonight as he stood up for Joseph. It was God. Oh, it was God. It was not Joseph. What did Joseph know? What did Joseph have? It was God that stood up for Joseph. Lord, stand up for us. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Papa, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up. These people don't want me to stand up, oh God. These people don't want me to go forward, oh God. These people don't want me to make it, oh God. Exactly what happened to Joseph, that was it. They didn't want him to make it. They didn't want him to go forward. They didn't want his dreams to be fulfilled. They didn't want him to have what God wants him to have. But God stood up. In the name of Jesus, Papa, stand up for me, O God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In my ministry, Papa, stand up for me, O God. Against those that don't want me to do ministry, O God. In my family, stand up for me, O God. Against those that don't want me to enjoy my wife, that don't want me to enjoy my husband, that don't want me to enjoy my family. Papa, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up. Stand up, stand up, stand up. Papa, look around on this prayer line tonight and stand up for the men. Papa, look around on this prayer line tonight and stand up for the women, oh God. Papa, look around this prayer line tonight and stand up for the young and the old, oh God. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the academic life, oh God, stand up for the students that are on this prayer line, oh God, on the job, oh God. Stand up for the professionals, O oh God, in the family, O oh God. Stand up for the men and the women on this prayer line tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, as you stood up for Joseph. Papa, come and stand up for us tonight in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight, that as God overruled the plot of Joseph's brothers, he will overrule any plot against your life in the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, as you overrule the plot of Joseph's brothers against him, overrule any plot, oh God, against my life also, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Any plot against my life, oh God, you can do it again. You will do it again in the name of Jesus. Any plot on my job, any plot in my family, any plot, oh God, in my ministry, any plot against me, oh God, from the pits of hell, any plot by devils and demons. Papa, I come before you, oh God, as you did it for Joseph, do it for me, oh God. Maybe you are not aware 
aware of any plot against your life, uh, just pray this prayer in advance uh, as God overruled uh, that no plot, no plot uh, will walk against your life in the name of Jesus. Uh, no plot will succeed against you in the name of Jesus. Uh, that the Lord will scatter them, the Lord will shatter them uh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, every plot against your life shall not prosper. I want you to pray tonight uh, as the one against Joseph did not prosper. Say, oh Lord, uh, let it not prosper in the name of Jesus. Uh, in the name of Jesus, I want you to pray tonight. Uh, say, oh Lord, uh, whatever I am under right now. Sometimes you are under something and you don't even know what it is. Uh, I want you to pray tonight. Uh, whether I know it or I don't know it. Uh, whether I see it or I don't see it. Uh, whatever plot against my life, uh, whether I'm already inside it or it's just coming my way. Uh, Papa, tonight overrule for me. Destroy them for me, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, bring me out. Bring me out. Bring me out. Uh, can I ask you to pray tonight that the Lord will bring you out? Uh, they threw him in the pit, uh, but the Lord brought him out. Uh, they threw him in the first prison, uh, but the Lord brought him out. Uh, they put him in the second prison, uh, but the Lord brought him out. Uh, I want you to pray tonight. Uh, anointing to be brought out. Uh, anointing to always be brought out. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, you know, sometimes we pray about the anointing to escape. Uh, this one is not the anointing to escape. Uh, they brought him out. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, I want you to pray for that anointing tonight. Uh, Lord, I stand before you, O oh God, uh, and I pray that you pour the oil upon my head, O oh God, uh, and pour it all over my life, O oh God. Uh, anointing to come out from whatever I am under. Some of us don't even know what we are under. We are just guessing maybe it is this or maybe it is that. Uh, and those things may be far from the real thing. Uh, but God knows it is the omniscient God. Uh, he's the one that has eyes all over his body. Uh, I want you to pray tonight and say, Thou, O oh God, uh, that has eyes all over your body, uh, I want you to see about me tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, uh, and any plot against my life uh, that you will overrule, 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 in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I want you to pray against conspiracies tonight. Uh, I want you to pray against conspiracies tonight. Uh, say, Lord, uh, anointing to be brought out. Let me go back a little bit. Uh, say, oh Lord, uh, anointing to be brought out uh, from whatever I am under right now. Uh, anointing to be brought out. Uh, I said Joseph was brought out from the pit. I said Joseph was brought out from prison one. I said Joseph was brought out from prison two. I want you to pray tonight anointing that says brought out in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, put a sign all over my life, oh God. Put a sign all over my business, oh God. Put a sign all over my ministry, oh God. Let it be two words brought out, brought out, declared free. Papa, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me, engineer it. I want you to open your mouth and talk to the Lord tonight, that the Lord will engineer your freedom tonight, that the Lord will bring you out of every pit, that the Lord will bring you out of every prison, that the Lord will bring you out of every half house, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Papa, wherever I am, oh God, we are need to be brought out. I may not even know that I need to be brought out from the places, but Lord, you know it, you see it. Papa, bring me out, bring me out, bring me out, bring me out, bring me out. In the name of Jesus, pray, 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 pray tonight that the Lord will bring you out, will bring you out safe, will bring you out alive, no matter what you are subjected to right now. Papa, in the realm of the Spirit, whatever I am subjected to, oh God, I pray that you will bring me out, bring the people on this prayer line out. 
In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, uh, can we pray against family conspiracies tonight? Uh, in the case of Joseph, uh, it was nothing but family conspiracies. Uh, I want you to decree tonight, uh, every family conspiracy against my life, uh, let it fall flat in the name of Jesus. Uh, their conspiracies backfired. Uh, I want you to pray tonight, uh, every family conspiracy against my life, uh, Papa, let it fall down flat. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, uh, any conspiracy on, in my family, O oh God, uh, any conspiracy in my immediate family, O oh God, uh, any conspiracy in my extended family, O oh God, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, you can be part of a family, but you are really not part of the family uh, because people don't like you, uh, because you are blessed, uh, because you are different. Uh, oh God, deliver us, deliver us, deliver us, deliver us. Uh, let no family conspiracy prosper against me, O oh God. Pray, 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 pray tonight. Uh, you know, Joseph, if he knew this, he would have prayed concerning his brothers. Uh, if Joseph knew what you are praying about tonight, uh, he probably would have fasted and prayed about it. Uh, but he had no idea about what his brothers were planning. Uh, I want you to pray tonight. Uh, whatever I don't have any idea of uh, that is being cooked up concerning me, O oh God, uh, overrule over over rule, over rule, over rule, over rule. You are the supreme court judge, oh God. You are the supreme justice, oh God. Papa, overrule all conspiracies, oh God, against my life. Overrule all conspiracies in my workplace. All conspiracies in my workplace. All conspiracies in my ministerial place. All conspiracies in my marital life. All conspiracies against my marriage. All conspiracies against my getting up and going for. Papa, destroy them tonight in the name of Jesus. All the brothers, they gathered and they had one voice. I want you to pray tonight. No matter how many of them are gathered together against you as a person, no matter how many are gathered together against you as a couple, no matter how many are gathered together against you as a church, the Lord will defeat them. The Lord will let them fall before you tonight in the name of Jesus. Jesus, in the name of Jesus, uh, conspirators, uh, conspirators, uh, fall down before me in the name of Jesus. Uh, all conspiracies, uh, fall down before me in the name of Jesus. Uh, all evil conspiracies, uh, all evil conspirators, uh, you shall not prosper from now on uh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, I want you to pray against conspiracies in the spirit, uh, conspiracies by devils and demons. Uh, conspiracies by familiar spirits. I want you to pray that God will not let them prosper against your life. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Listen to this, oh, this man. They were blood of his blood, oh. They were flesh of his flesh, oh. But they hated his destiny. They hated his destiny. Like they hate your destiny. I want you to pray tonight that blood of my blood, oh Lord. Blood of my blood, flesh of my flesh who don't like where I'm going, who don't like where God is taking me to. They have seen my star. They have seen where I'm going and they don't like it. I want you to pray tonight. Lord, let their hatred amount to nothing in the name of Jesus. Papa, let their hatred against my destiny amount to nothing in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Maybe you left an office and you wanted to go and start your business and they said your business will not prosper and you are seeing it to be the truth. I want you to bring that before God and say, Lord, let it not prosper in the name of Jesus. Maybe you left a church to start your own church and they vow that your church will not prosper. I want you to pray tonight that as the hatred for Joseph amounted to nothing, let the hatred for my ministry amount to nothing in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Maybe they didn't want you to marry the woman you married. Married. Maybe they didn't want you to marry the man you married and they are doing everything to destroy your marriage. I want you to pray tonight. Let it amount to nothing in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Maybe they didn't want you to buy the house that you bought and now you are having difficulty to pay your bills because they tied everything up so you can lose your house. I want you to pray, oh God, whatever is warring against you in the name of Jesus, whatever is 
is warring against your destiny in the name of Jesus. Uh, Papa, let it not prosper, let it not prosper, let it not prosper in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I want you to pray tonight that those who are not happy uh, because of your exalted position in the family, uh, they saw the position of Joseph, uh, they saw what was coming upon Joseph, uh, and they were not happy, uh, and they planned, uh, and they plotted. Uh, I want you to pray that the Lord will overrule their plans, uh, the Lord will overrule their plots, uh, those that are unhappy uh, because of where you are going, uh, those that are unhappy uh, because of God's destination for you, uh, those that are not happy uh, because of God's designation for you, uh, and destination for you, uh, I want you to pray that all their plans uh, will fall down flat. Uh, God will overrule their plans. Uh, God will overrule their plots. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, pray that prayer concerning where you walk. Uh, God has given you favor where you walk. Uh, and some are not happy. Uh, God, oh God, uh, God has given you favor with your wife. Uh, God has given you favor with your husband. Uh, and some are not happy. Uh, I want you to pray, oh God. God, whatever they plan, whatever they plot, Lord overrule tonight, Lord overrule tonight, Lord overrule tonight, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Simply put, their plan was to overthrow. Did you hear what I said? Their plan was to overthrow the destiny of Joseph. I want you to pray in the name of Jesus. Say a decree. Say, I declare, my destiny shall not be overthrown by family members in the name of Jesus. Family members of my wife's house, family members of my husband's house, my family shall, my, my, my destiny shall not be overthrown by them. My destiny shall not be overthrown. The destiny of my children shall not be overthrown in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Whoever it is in my family, oh Lord, small uncles, uh, great uncles, uh, the papa that sits on the stool, uh, papa, they shall not prosper in the name of Jesus. Uh, decree it, uh, declare it, uh, and it shall be established by the God of heaven. Uh, say, my destiny shall not be overthrown. Uh, say, I decree and I declare, it shall not be overthrown. Uh, it will not be overthrown. Uh, it must not be overthrown. Uh, say, Holy Father, don't allow it, don't allow it, don't allow it. Uh, my destiny shall not be overthrown. Uh, my destiny must must not be overthrown. My destiny will not be overthrown by family members in the name of Jesus. If you know people who are out to do that, why don't you call their names in this prayer meeting to God and say, Mr. So-and-so, Mrs. So-and-so, Miss So-and-so, that is determined to fight where I'm going, that is determined to fight my destiny. Oh Lord, in the name of Jesus, overrule their plans, overthrow their plans. If it's a woman, mention her name. If it's a man, mention her name. If you are really, really, really sure, then bring your prayers before God and be very, very, very specific tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, the junior wants to your husband, the junior wants to your wife, the senior wants to your husband, the senior wants to your wife. We are talking about family problems tonight destiny changes tonight. Uh, they wanted to change the destiny of uh, Joseph. Uh, and they succeeded for a while. Uh, I want you to pray, 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 pray tonight. Uh, my destiny shall not be overthrown uh, by family members. Uh, the destiny of your marriage shall not be overthrown. Uh, the destiny of your ministry shall not be overthrown. Uh, the destiny of your business shall not be overthrown. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, I want you to pray that one by one God will retire them in your husband's house. God, but one by one God will retire them in your wife's house. One by one God will retire them on your job. One by one in the name of Jesus. If it's on your job, they will be transferred. Transferred far, far, far to Wyoming, to Arizona. Somewhere far in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray, pray, pray tonight. Lord, give me victory over the 
where destiny changes in my family. Uh, give me victory over those that are fighting me in my family. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I want you to make that decree. My destiny uh, shall not be overthrown by family members. Uh, I want you to also pray another prayer tonight. Uh, say my future. Ah, yes. Uh, say my future. Because I was a problem with this man. He was his future. Oh, my future shall not be changed by those who I wrongly trust. He trusted them, but he was wrong. He should not have trusted them. I want you to pray, oh Lord, those who I trust, but they are thrusting me through with bow and arrow and spear. Papa, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. They are supposed to be blood of my blood. They are supposed to be flesh of my flesh. Who should I trust but my brothers? Who should I trust but my father? Who should I trust but my mother? But we have seen in the story of Joseph. Ah, man is wicked. I want you to pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight uh, that those who you wrongly trusted for years, uh, those who you you told secrets for years, uh, and now they are using the information they know about you against you. uh, I want you to pray in the name of Jesus that from now they shall not prosper. Papa, let them not prosper. Papa, let them not prosper. Papa, overrule and cancel what they've done against me, O God. uh, In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, uh, all those that have trusted, oh God, uh, and they have proved themselves tr- untrustworthy. Uh, I pray that you will deliver me from their hands uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, can I ask you to pray prayer for yourself? Uh, I want you to pray tonight that the Lord will lead you who to talk to and who not to talk to in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray that the Lord will put a bridle in your tongue. The Lord will help you to be quiet where you need to be quiet, only to talk when you need to talk. That you will not share information. Hey! You will not share information with those who will war against you and destroy you. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight that control, 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 control. The Lord will control your lips. The Lord will control your tongues that you will not give to enemies information that they can use against you. Many of us like to boast about our children that you will be quiet about your children where you need to be quiet. You will be quiet about your achievements where you need to be quiet. You will be quiet about your husband, about your wife where you need to be quiet. You will be quiet about your business prosperity where you need to be quiet. Papa, touch me, touch me touch me control me control my tongue oh god in the name of jesus in the name of jesus my future shall not be changed by those that have given information to can i ask you to pray tonight that information that they have from you that they are using against you papa let it be useless in their hands from now on let it be useless in their hands from tonight on every information that they have about me and my family oh god every information that they have about me and my family, oh God, that they are using against me to bring me down. They are using against me to prolong my journey into destiny. I want you, Lord, to deliver me and let it be useless in their hands. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Can I tell you something? After this man dreamt that dream, after this man told that dream, they blocked it for 21 years. Yes. Uh, that's what Bible numerology tells us. Uh, that's what Bible timeline tells us. Uh, it took him so long because they fought him. Uh, I want you to pray tonight. Every delay you are experiencing right now, every delay that you are experiencing right now, uh, every stoppage that you are experiencing right now, uh, every standstill that you are experiencing right now, uh, every inability to move forward that you are experiencing right now, uh, because some people got some information uh, and they p- gave you the vaccine of delay. Uh, they gave you the shot of delay. Uh, I want you to say, Lord, deliver me, 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 deliver me. Let them not prolong my journey any longer. Let my journey not be prolonged, oh God. Uh, my journey to destination, my journey to destiny, oh God. Uh, let them not turn it into 21 years wait. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, uh, Papa, 
hasten my victory. Papa, hasten my deliverance. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You know what they said about him when he was coming to his brothers to feed them? They said, here comes the dreamer. Hey, here comes the dreamer. They gave him a nickname. Yes, they gave him a nickname. I want you to pray about that tonight. Only God knows the nickname they call you behind the doors. Only God knows the nickname they call you in the covens. Say every nickname that they gave me shall walk in my favor. In the name of Jesus. Every nickname, every nickname, every nickname that they have given me shall walk in my favor. Shall walk in my favor. Begin to walk, begin to walk in my favor. Begin to walk, begin to walk in my favor. Begin to walk, begin to walk in my favor. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ of... <laughs> The reason I'm laughing, oh, uh, the reason I'm laughing, the reason I'm laughing uh, is because uh, I, I said in, in a church one day that God spoke to me. I had the voice of God uh, and I told them, oh, I wasn't wise. I told them what God spoke to me. Uh, and you know what they started calling me uh, after that? Uh, they said he's hearing voices. <laughs> They said the man is hearing voices. Oh God, let that be real. Let me hear the voices of God. Let me hear the voices of angels. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let me hear the voices of heavenly hosts. What they said in jest. What they said in ridicule concerning me. What they said about me that is really not what it is. But they are trying to give me a nickname. They hear our voices. Papa turn me into that from tonight. Let me be a hearer of the voices of angels. Let me be a hearer of the voices of the heavenly host. That when I stand to minister, let me hear the voice of heaven. Let me hear the voice of angels. I want you to pray tonight. They call you a dreamer. I want you to pray that you will be a dreamer and your dream will come true in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. They call you a gold digger. I want you to pray tonight that gold will be your portion in the name of Jesus. Not the way they are calling you, you know, but in the way that is good. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I said every nickname, every nickname that they have given me begin to walk in my favor in the name of Jesus. Every nickname, every nickname they have given me, oh God, let it walk in my favor in the name of Jesus. Let it walk in my favor in the name of Jesus. Let it walk in my favor in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Every negative name turn it to positive. Every negative name turn it into positive. Here comes the dreamer. Every nickname they give me, oh God, let it begin to walk in my favor, oh God. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight. I want you to pray tonight. In the name of Jesus. He will deliver you, deliver you, deliver me. Oh, everybody say, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. In the name of Jesus, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me from every land of hardship that they have sentenced me into, O oh God. Every land of hardship that they have sentenced me into, O oh God. Papa, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. Come and open your mouth and pray tonight. It's like they sentenced this man to hardship. It's like they sentenced Joseph to hardship. I want you to tell the Lord any hardship that is in my life. O oh God, hardship, hardship, hardship. Papa, turn it around, oh God, and release me, release me, release me, release me. Everything about the health so hard. Everything about making money so difficult. Everything about raising children so difficult is hardship. Oh, if they kill your wife, then you are the only one to face the hardship of raising children. If they kill your husband, it is you that is, oh Lord, giving the task of raising your children. Whatever hardship you are under right now. Say, Papa, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Every hardship I've been sentenced to, every hardship I've been silenced to, every hardship I have been sold to, Papa, deliver me from tonight. Papa, deliver me from tonight. Pray, 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 pray. Say, oh Lord, say they belong to the lower court. Yes. The brothers of Joseph, 
They belong to the lower court. I want you to pray tonight. Say Supreme Court of Heaven. Supreme Court of Heaven. Overrule the judgment of every lower court against my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every judgment of the lower court against my life. Oh, Supreme Justice in Heaven. Overrule for me, oh God. Rule it in my favor tonight. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every ruling of every wicked court. Papa, overrule, overrule, overrule. Overrule, 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 overrule. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight that whatever sentence have been issued against your life, the Lord will reverse them tonight. These are serious prayers. If you will pray them with all your heart, you will see a change. Even beginning tonight, in the name of Jesus, that whatever sentence have been issued against your life, whatever sentence has been issued against your marriage, whatever sentence has been issued against your prosperity, Whatever sentence has been issued against your children, Papa reverse from tonight. Papa reverse from tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Every sentence that has been pronounced, you are the overruler, O oh God. Come and overrule for me in the name of Jesus. You are the gracious overruler, Lord. Come and overrule for me, O oh God. Every plan to do me wrong. Pray, 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 pray tonight. Every plan to do me wrong. Let the plan of God for his for your life uh, overturn any plan to do you wrong. Uh, yes, they wanted to do him wrong, uh, but the plan of God <laughs> did not allow their plan to work. Uh, see, every plan to do me wrong, oh God, uh, let your plan for my life overturn them, overturn them, overturn them. Uh, Papa, overturn them, overturn them, overturn them. Uh, every plan to do me wrong, uh, let your plan overturn them, oh God. Uh, let your plan for my life, oh Lord, uh, overturn and swallow up uh, all the plans of the enemy in the name of Jesus. Uh, all the plans of family members against me, O oh Lord. Uh, Papa, overturn them, overturn them, overturn them, overturn them uh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Uh, can we pray another prayer tonight, people? Uh, that like Joseph. Uh, everybody say like Joseph. Uh, mm. Say like Joseph. Uh, let those who don't want me to Hallelujah. Let those who don't want me end up depending on my, on me to leave. In the name of Jesus. Wasn't that what happened to Joseph? Those who didn't want him, they ended up depending on him to leave. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Papa shock and surprise them that those who don't want me will end up depending on me for their daily bread, for their daily provision. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus, those who don't want me, O oh God, let them be forced to want me, O oh God. Those who don't care about me, O oh God, let them be compelled to care about me, O oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, those who want me dead, let them be the ones who will be coming to me, O oh God, as a dependent. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, like Joseph, O oh God, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. You know what Joseph said? He said, God save me so that others can be saved. I want you to pray tonight. And so many people were saved as a result of the saving of Joseph because he was able to feed so many, pe many people from many countries. I want you to pray that like Joseph, the Lord would deliver you for the good of many, 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 many people. You look at it for a minute. If you can just be delivered, if you can just be delivered, can you imagine how many people would benefit from it? Seriously, if you can pass your exam, do you know how many people will benefit from you having your license? Do you know how many people will benefit? If you can have children, do you know how many people will benefit from you having children? Everything that you don't have, there are people who are losing. I want you to pray there for tonight. Say, oh Lord, deliver me, deliver me like Joseph uh, for the good of many, 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 many people. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, Papa, deliver me, deliver me like you delivered Joseph. Uh, Joseph said you delivered him uh, so that lives can be saved. Uh, I want you to pray tonight that the Lord 
Lord will deliver you so that lives can be saved, so that lives can be impacted. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Papa, deliver me for the good of others. In the name of Jesus, deliver me for the good of others, oh God. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, can we pray for your healing tonight? I feel we need to pray for your healing tonight. Many of you are carrying, oh God, you are carrying wounds, wounds all over you in the name of Jesus. Many of you are carrying internal wounds. Many of you are carrying unseen wounds. Many of you are carrying emotional wounds that when you talk about what your brothers have done, when you talk about what your siblings have done, when you talk about what family members have done to your marriage, you just burst into tears and cry and cry and cry. I want you to pray tonight. A lot of harms. And maybe that's why God talked about discouragement at the beginning. I want you to pray tonight that every discouragement in this prayer meeting tonight, the Lord will swallow them up with encouragement in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. People, let us pray, let us pray, let us pray. Say, oh Lord, encourage anyone that is discouraged tonight. Lift up anyone that is down tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I want you to pray, 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 pray tonight. Let's pray for one another tonight. Say, whoever may be on this prayer line tonight that is down, whoever may be on this prayer line tonight that is discouraged, whoever may be on this prayer line tonight that is depressed, whoever may be on this prayer line tonight that don't want to go forward anymore, I want you to say after me, say spirit of encouragement, say spirit of encouragement, say possess everyone on this prayer line, Papa possess us, possess us, possess us, spirit of encouragement in every way possess us, where we are about to give up, where we are about to stop praying, we are about to stop fasting, we are about to stop believing God, Papa, oh God, release unto us tonight the spirit of encouragement, the spirit of encouragement in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I said I want us to pray for healing tonight. I want you to pray tonight where you have been harmed, where you have been harmed. Many of us have been wounded, where you have been wounded. Yea, Lord, where we have been wounded, oh God, by what family members did, where they have wounded us. Oh Lord, heal us tonight. Oh Lord, heal us tonight. I want you to pray that as many as are on this prayer line that have been wounded by family members. The Lord will touch them. The Lord will heal them. I command healing to come to you right now. I command encouragement to come to you right now. I command the lifting up to come to you right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want us to pray for healing. 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 Healing of hearts. Healings of pains. Healings of hearts. Healings of pains. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want you to tell the Lord tonight, uh, as many as I on this prayer line tonight, uh, Father, we pray for them and we pray for ourselves. Uh, anyone that is hurting tonight, uh, anyone that is in pain tonight, uh, Papa, encourage them, encourage them, encourage them, encourage them. Whoever is in pain, oh God, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, whoever has burdens on their hearts, uh, and these burdens have been afflicted uh, by the brothers of Joseph, uh, their own brothers, they their own sisters. I want you to pray tonight in the name of Jesus on this prayer line where they have succeeded to hurt people. Papa, let there be healing, 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 healing. Healing of pains, healing of hearts on this prayer line tonight. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Whoever have been hurt, O oh God, whoever may be in pain, O oh God, as a result of what has been done to them, O oh God, and they're on this prayer line. They can't even pray, they are just looking. They can't pray, they are just looking because they don't even see the way out. Yes, we want to pray for those people tonight, those who don't see the way out, those who don't know how. Uh, Lord God, deliver them, deliver them, deliver them, deliver them in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, those who don't know the outcome, uh, I want us to pray that the overruler will give them a happy outcome. Uh, those who don't know how it will work out, uh, I want us to pray to the overruler tonight uh, that the Almighty will overrule for them uh, and let mm. it work out in their favor. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, Papa, 
whatever anyone is going through tonight. Oh Lord, let favor bring them out. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight that the Lord will heal you, heal you, heal you of any pain that anyone has afflicted upon you, of any pain that want anyone has injected into you. I want you to pray tonight. Any pain that has been injected into you by family like the family of Joseph, maybe it's the extended family in your own case, maybe it's your wife's family in your own case, maybe it's your husband's family in your own case, whatever it is, maybe even the family of God. We are talking about church and ministry that have inflicted you and afflicted you with this pain. I want you, Lord God, to heal us, heal us, heal us, heal us. You are the one that has the balm of Gilead. Papa, touch us tonight, heal us tonight, touch us tonight, heal us tonight, touch us tonight. Heal us tonight, oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, let there be healing all over this prayer line tonight. Let there be encouragement all over this prayer line tonight. Let there be strength all over this prayer line tonight. Let there be grace poured out all over this prayer line tonight. By his stripes, we were healed. By his stripes, we were healed. I want you to pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight. Every stripe that has been laid upon you, Lord Jesus will make you whole. Every stripe that has been laid upon you tonight, say, oh Lord, every stripe that my brothers like Joseph brothers, every stripe that my in-laws like the people of brothers of Joseph, any stripe that people in my church have laid on me, oh God, physically and spiritually, oh God, Papa heal me tonight, Papa heal me tonight, by your stripes we were healed, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I want you to pray that the Lord will undo, 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 the Lord will undo any plan, Papa come and undo any plan tonight, Papa come and do any plan, any plan, any plan, come and undo any plan, oh God, overrule any negative plan against me, oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, whatever plan is against my life, Papa, you are the overruler, overrule them. You are the overruler, overrule them. You are the overruler, overrule them. Whatever has been done, undo them in the name of Jesus. Whatever has been planned, O Lord, cancel them. Whatever has been done, O Lord, undo them. Whatever has been ruled, O Lord, overrule them. Every ruling, O God, in witchcraft covens. Every ruling, O God, in witchcraft covens, every ruling, O oh God, in witchcraft covens, every ruling, O oh God, under the waters, every ruling, O oh God, under the rocks, every ruling, O oh God, in the third heavens, Papa, cancel them, cancel them against my life, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, whatever they have written and, and executed, I want you to pray, 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 pray tonight, that whatever has been executed against you in the realm of the spirit, the Lord will cancel them in the realm of the spirit for you tonight. They executed it against Joseph and it almost destroyed him. I want you to say I shall not be destroyed by any family family wickedness. I shall not be destroyed by any family wickedness oh God. Family wickedness church wickedness. Immediate wickedness in the family. Family oh God could be your father your mother, your brother, your sister whatever they have executed I want God to nullify their plan in the name of Jesus. I want them to nullify their plan in the name of Jesus. Did you hear what they did to Joseph? They sold him to Egypt. I want you to pray tonight. Wherever I have been sold into and whatever I have been sold into, oh Lord, turn it around, turn it around, turn it around, turn it around. Wherever I have been sold into, oh God, turn it into a path of destiny for me, oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight. No matter how rough your path is, no matter how rough your path to destiny is, you will endure. You will endure and you will achieve in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Can I ask you to pray prayer tonight? Grace not to give up. Mm. Jesus. 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 Grace. 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 <laughs> It's easy to give up, oh, are you not a human being? Flesh and blood. Say, oh, Lord, let me not give up until I reach my destination. Let me not give up until I see things turn around. Let me not give up until my story changes. In the name of Jesus, 
Open your mouth and pray tonight, Father God, Father God, Father God, Father God. Let me not give up until my story changes, O oh God. Let me not give up until my destiny I reach in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Papa, let me not give up, O oh Lord, in the middle of the battle, O oh God. Let me not give up, O oh Lord, until the war, the war is over, O oh God. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me, deliver me. Any prison that I have found myself uh, on my way to destiny. Pray, 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 pray tonight. Uh, whatever about you has been imprisoned, uh, pray, 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 pray tonight. Uh, whatever about you has been imprisoned, uh, the Lord will open the prison door for you. Uh, somebody was telling me yesterday that they think their dream has been imprisoned. Uh, tonight is your night of freedom. Pray, pray tonight. Uh, whatever it is about your life. Uh, some of us used to dream dreams, uh, and I'm talking graphic dreams. Uh, and the thing just stop like that. Bwah! No more dreams. I want you to pray tonight. Whatever has been imprisoned in my life. Some of us, our finances have been imprisoned. Some of us, oh God, our intelligence has been imprisoned. Ability to remember stuff has been imprisoned. In the name of Jesus, whatever it is about you that is in Potiphar's prison, the Lord will bring you out. Papa, bring me out of any prison. Bring out anything that belongs to me from heaven every prison in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I want witchcraft prisons to open for me right now. I want witchcraft prisons to open for me right now. I want Obia prison to open for me right now. That is why things look so difficult. They've tied you up and bound you up and locked you up. I pray that wherever I've been locked into, oh God, Papa, open the gate, open the door in the name of Jesus. I want you to command, command, command tonight. Uh, lift up your heads, O ye gates, uh, and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors. Uh, open the gate, open the door, open the gate, uh, angels of God. Uh, oh Lord, bring the master key, O God. Uh, you are the one that has the key of David. Uh, you are the one that openeth and no man shutteth. Uh, you are the one that shutteth and no man openeth. Uh, I want you to open your mouth and talk to the Lord uh, that whichever prison you have been sentenced into, your health has been sentenced into, uh, your marriage has been sentenced into, uh, your ministry has been sentenced into, uh, your business has been sentenced into, uh, your professional life has been sentenced into. Father, any prison, any prison, any prison, uh, Papa, let there be a release tonight. Uh, let there be a release tonight. Let there be a release tonight. Let there be a release tonight. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, uh, Papa, bring me out, bring me out, bring me out, bring me out uh, from any prison. Uh, Joseph was in two prisons. So Joseph was in two prisons. I want you to pray tonight. No matter how many prisons I have been, no matter how many prisons I am in, Papa, release me, release me, overrule, O oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Just today, just today, the president, the outgoing president of the United States released so many people from prison. I read about a man who was sentenced to 33 years in prison. He only have seven years old. Oh my God. Imagine how many years he still had left. 26 years left. And the president said, go home. Go home. You are free. Hallelujah. I want you to pray tonight. Oh Lord, pronounce, 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 pronounce. If ex-president Trump, former president Trump, can release prisoners. Papa, you are able. You have the power. You have the authority. He released those people and there's nothing anybody can do about it. Did you hear what I said? He released those people today and those who don't want them free, there's nothing they can do. He has released them, he has released them. He has the authority to release them. Even if you don't like him, he has released them, he has released them. Nobody can throw them back into prison and say, well, he has gone. We are putting you back. No, he's done and he's done. I want you to tell the Lord tonight, uh, uh, if, if an ex-president can do that, how much more the God of heaven in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, you are kinder than anybody on this earth. Papa, you are kinder than any president on this earth. Any prison that I'm in, oh God, 
sign the declaration of my release in the name of Jesus. Papa, I want to be free to function. I want to be free to function wherever family members, physically and spiritually, have banished me, O oh God. Wherever they have tied me into, O oh God. Wherever they have locked me up into, O oh God. 33 years sentence, and I've been there for seven years, and it remains 26 years. Papa, today put an end, put an end, put an end to my sentence. Papa, today put an end, put an end, put an end to my sentence. Once you overrule, it is overruled. Papa, rule in my favor, rule in my favor. I don't deserve to be released. Oh, the man that was released, he didn't deserve to be released, but the president just had mercy on him. I want you to open your mouth and pray wherever you are tonight. Say, Lord, mercy, 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 mercy. Mercy is what I cry for tonight. Mercy is what I pray for tonight. Papa, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. The first prison he got released by the favor and the mercy of God. The second prison he got released by the mercy and the favor of God. Papa, I feel constrained. Papa, I feel restrained. And if you look at your life, you see a restraint. You are not enjoying the freedom you need to enjoy. You are in prison, my brother. Pay for a release tonight. Uh, Papa, release me, release me, release me, release me. Release me from prison in my family. Release me from prison in my ministry. Release me from prison in my profession. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, Papa, do me help, do me help, do me help. Help me, Lord. Uh, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, can I ask you to do something tonight? This may surprise you. It was the gifts that Joseph had that ultimately ultimately released him from prison. I want you to pray tonight uh, that it was the gift. God engineered gifts uh, in the life of Joseph uh, and those gifts uh, led to his release. Uh, I want you to pray tonight gifts of the spirit, uh, all kinds of gifts uh, in the name of Jesus. Lord, pour them into my life. Uh, the gift of wisdom, uh, the gift of understanding, uh, the gift of knowledge. Uh, you'll be surprised how many gifts uh, separate from the nine gifts of the Holy Ghost. Uh, can be used of God to bring about your release. I want you to pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight. Pray about a particular gift that you really want God to give you. Is there a gift that you want God to give you? Well, 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 Solomon asked for gift of wisdom. You can ask for any gift you want tonight. In the name of Jesus, Papa, answer prayer tonight all over this prayer line. Whatever gift people are asking you for tonight, Father, whatever gift will help them to make freedom, whatever gift will help them to come out of any prison, Papa, give it to them, give it to them, give it to them, the gift that will cause them to fulfill destiny. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, give to them, give to them, give to them, give to them. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, oh. Oh Lord, arise, 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 in the name of Jesus. My goodness, the time is gone. I want you to pray tonight. We're about to close. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, I want you to pray tonight. Say, oh Lord, make those who said I will not become to watch me become. In the name of Jesus. Did you hear what I said? Say, oh Lord, those who said I will not become, let them watch me become. Make them watch me become. Make them watch me become. Those who said I will not become, cause them to watch me become. Become great. Become mighty. Become great. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight. Make those who said I will not become, watch me become. Make those who vowed that I will not rise. Make them watch me rise. Did you hear what I said? <laughs> Hey, they said he will not become. He became. They said he will not rise. He rose. I said they said he will not rise. He rose. That's exactly what they said about Jesus. They said he will not rise, but he rose. I want you to pray, 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 pray tonight. We're about to close. Those that have vowed that you will not rise, I want you to tell the Lord before their eyes, let me rise in the name of Jesus. Those who have vowed I will not rise before their eyes, let me rise. 
lives. Those who have vowed that it is finished with me. In the name of Jesus, let them see me rise. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight, pray tonight. That those who said you will not rise, they will prostrate before you. They have vowed that they will not bow to you. But not only will they bow, they will prostrate before you. In the name of Jesus. Say, oh Lord, make them prostrate before me. Everything they said they will not do. Everything they said they do not do. Everything they vowed they will not do. Compel them to do it. In the name of Jesus. Exalt me, O God. In the name of Jesus. Let me give you one more prayer point. In the name of Jesus. I think it will be unfair if I don't give you this one. Say, O Lord, come on. Say, O Lord, come on. Say, O Lord. Say, keep me humble. Keep me forgiving. When you exalt me in the presence of my family. When you exalt me in the presence of my office workers. When you exalt me uh, in the presence of my equals in my profession, uh, when you exalt me uh, in the presence of my church members, uh, when you exalt me uh, in the presence of my family members, uh, say, Oh Lord, uh, keep me humble, keep me forgiven, keep me humble, keep me forgiven, because that's exactly who Joseph was. Uh, keep me humble, Oh God, uh, keep me forgiven, Oh God, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Uh, now begin to thank God for answering your prayers. We got to stop now. Begin to give God the praise. Begin to give God the glory. Begin to give God the honor. Begin to give God the dominion. Begin to give God the majesty. Thank God for the change he has brought into your life. Thank God for the encouragement he has brought into your life. Glory be to his name. Honor be to his name. Dominion be to his name. Bless him. Worship him. Thank him for answering your prayers. Glory be to him. Honor be to him. Lord, we bless you, Lord. We worship you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty, mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. And amen. And amen. And amen. I want to thank you all for joining us tonight. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you all for joining us. Thank you all for being with us. God that we serve is the overruler. Hey, tomorrow you are going to see God in display again because he's the overruler. I'm going to take you to another scripture tomorrow and we're going to use that to pray. And I believe that every area of your life where the enemy thinks, oh, they are in charge or where troubles of life, where circumstances of life think they are in charge, the Lord will overrule for you before this weekend week is over, and you'll have a testimony to give. Thank you all for coming tonight. We'll bless the name of the Lord for you. We admonish you to please go online and be a blessing to this ministry, and the Lord will bless you abundantly also in Jesus' name. Let's share the grace together as we go home tonight. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen and amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen and amen. <coughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you all for coming tonight. We we'll bless the name of the Lord for you, and I wish you a peaceful night rest. Until tomorrow, this is Bishop saying, good night.